Hello guys, what is up? It is the Lost Story 45 and I am bringing you another video with my 107 and 36 demolition gameplay. You're going to have to wait one second guys. Okay, I am back and I can be louder now so you guys can probably hear me now. Sorry about that, I had to close the door so that I wouldn't be screaming while the whole house is asleep because it is 5.30 in the morning and I am about to go to school. But I wanted to bring you guys uh a video that I could quickly render up while I was waiting for uh, school to get out and this is it uh, in this video we're continuing uh, not the same lecture but continuing a uh, the what would you say even I would say we're continuing the gameplay and we're continuing the same attitude that um, a lot of good stuff is happening and it's great to be alive, I guess you could say, as my gym teacher likes to say. Um, first thing first, I kind of want to talk about was how to get happier, I will say, in this case. And it's letting go of what you've done, what you're going to do, and of what could happen. Because, I mean, you can't really live until you say that you messed up. And... The truth behind that is because, you know, if you go your whole life thinking that you've done everything absolutely correct, and you've never messed up once in your life, you're bound to repeat your same mistakes. It's something that history has taught us, and if you've gone to history class ever, you know exactly what I'm talking about. History has taught us that if we repeat our mistakes, big problems happen, and it's best not to repeat our mistakes because of that. And that's gotten us very, very, very far in life. And because of it, we've done amazing feats because we realized that it's time for us to let go of the past and time to move on to the future but time to make sure that the past is also playing a role in our future I mean it's not like a skill that gradually comes it's a skill that has to happen through time because you can't one day wake up and say today I am never going to ever mess up any pronunciations again I'm going to make the world's best videos, I'm going to be amazing at everything, and you're going to never ever trip, fall, smack yourself, or do anything poorly again. It just doesn't happen. You slowly learn what not to do, and that will slowly build up a basis of how you should be acting. And it's what, cr when people say that you go into manhood, that's what crafts into us uh, what's called manhood, or for girl, you girls, womanhood. It, it's just what happens because you have to make a mistake and you have to learn. And I'm not gonna say that people haven't gotten by without doing it, but they have gotten by poorly without doing it. If you look at Hitler, he didn't let go. Uh, he grew up in a family where his stepdad was horrible, and. He mistreated his mom, and it was a horrible scenario, and he didn't let go of that. He suspected that it was a Jew, he went to kill all Jews. And on the way, he decided to take down every other thing he thought wrong. It, how it happened, it's a sad thing that it happened that way, but it did happen that way. And if he had realized, perhaps, that instead of hurting others for the mistakes of one man, he could perhaps help others who are in his same scenario. I am sure the Earth would have been a better place during that time period. Though, do not get me wrong, we have learned a lot from the fall of Hitler. It would have been better, I think, to not have to learn it how we did learn it. And perhaps to learn it in a way where we would be in control of the scenario better than we were. Because America at the time ignored the situation until it finally happened that we need to go. And I'm not going to say America's stupid for that, because you shouldn't go starting wars where you don't need to, but I'm sure we could have adjusted to that scenario better. So, now that we've managed to go all the way from being happier to Hitler, let's bring it back to the gameplay for a bit uh, and talk about the future of my gameplay. I've already told you what games I'm going to be playing in the future. Uh, look forward to them. Maybe look forward to some other stuff. Who knows? But 
I am really hoping to find some other people to do dual comms with because I realize that dual comms definitely are helpful for A channels and B they are extremely fun to do. So look forward to maybe some dual comms coming up. If you want to do a dual comm with me, just tell me if you've got a game plan you want to do, or if we should do one of mine. If you uh uh, I don't know, just tell me exactly what you want to do, and I'll work my end on it, and you can see what can happen. Uh, I'm going to tell you right now, I'm not very good at remembering things, so I will probably have to make a note, and I'm probably going to have to make a note to remind me of that note, because that's how it happens. But, here is the end of this gameplay, guys. Have a nice day. Remember to like, just like a favorite, subscribe, and comment, all that stuff, and I'll see you on the far side, guys. Five minutes, that's short.